<laughs> it's wonderful. God, that's wonderful. Tremendous. Videotape of you all. Oh yeah. Oh, that and here he is. That was so good. Thirty-five years later, playing the same medley. <laughs> Well, it's one of those, I thought you did great, but it's an arrangement you don't know in your sight read. I thought you did. <laughs> well, you know, Tom came in once to our house and played uh, Fantasy and Promise. And I, it just, I was just in, uh, as a freshman in high school, and I heard him play that, and I thought, darn, I'd like to learn how to play that song. But it was miles ahead of stanza. And I played it again and again and again. And one five, the other one six. Or it, was a, it was a weird... Anyway, so I fooled around and learned how to play that song. Even though I couldn't play anything else that was even remotely close to that, that you know, that com complexity. But just that perseverance. I was going to do it. I was going to do it. Okay, that's the result. I said, Trent, do you well, remember no, it? Well, no, I mean, I, I, it's been so long, it'd be too rusty, but, and so then, anyway, the Don I've got the music. Along, and he hears me play again. Fantasy Impromptu. And he, the same thing with him. He said, he got, he got well, caught I, the bug. I'll tell you, Trent, I, well, what like coming Fantasy here, would you? But by the time I, she's going to come out and ride the tractor with me. One of these days, aren't you? We're going to have a good old time right now. <laughs> 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 well, there's a glass right by your feet over there, Dave. But Donald did, did it differently, table. though. What he did was, uh, he learned to play it when it was way above his head. <laughs> and then he kept taking lessons. And he got to be better and better to the point that he can play lots of songs that are as good as Fantasy Impromptu. Oh, really nice. And so he went back and learned how to play That's Fantasy Impromptu after he got good enough to really be able to play it. So he... You kind of got a double whammy. You got the first time. Yeah, that's right. right. He did spend weeks. <laughs> well, of course, he was also oh, memorizing it, which seems to uh, oh. I like the way you play, John. Good night, sleep, honey. Good night, sleep, honey. You want a bat? Let's see that. Did you inherit your talent from your mother? Yeah, her, her, fam my her famous is way is, I can't carry a tune to basket. I'm not even sure of what she said. Good night, sweetie. Really. Really. I'm not sure about that. Scott, you need to do me. Everyone's head nine and hugs now. We'll leave Mr. Power Ranger here. No, I'm not a Power Ranger. No, okay. Okay. They're not going to show you. two in UK. It's like a treasure right now, doesn't it? Put in the ball. Put in the ball. Yeah, that's good. Your dad dove in. Shallow. He hit her and his feet just sort of stayed out of the water. <laughs> <laughs> and they, I guess they never already ever went back. She was. Your dad and then the guy who's going to be a dentist. Um, the guy who's going to be a dentist was a pretty aggressive guy. And one day your, she had met your dad. And he, the other guy, met him. And he was coming to see Mary. And he said, Basically, Mary's mine, and I want you to stay out of her because you're our wife. Which one said that? And your dad answered and said, "If I was sure of that as you are, I would. But I think I don't think you're right." Yeah. And your he went ahead and won Mary's favor. He said something about the best man. Something like that. And and you happened. Down a little bit later. <laughs> yes, how come she got to be in there, John? Several months later. <laughs> oh, I bet Mary was that pretty nerve wracking. They both show up. The and, gra time. and Grandma Barnhart was so glad that uh, your mother chose the girl. Because that guy was a nice guy, but he just well. was sort of uptight. And uh, he used to say, he, was, he used oh. to say, I know who's going to be the favorite son in son in law around here. Because there was two guys pursuing your mother. And, and, and SD felt that Grandma favored the other guy. That was your dad, that was Earl, your dad. So, how's that for a personal story? Well, see, SD, I mean, he was a good dancer. And Mary was a good dancer, too. And I mean, they went out and that really impressed me because I mean, they could dance really something. So, I kind of like them. <laughs> <laughs>
thing. <laughs> <laughs> but then you met Uncle Dave, and he was so much better at dancing. Oh, I wouldn't say that. I can't see. I guess he was. He was I did. I mean, he just went on the floor and did all these fancy things, you know.